Hello everybody and welcome to Dr. Chad's video blog of the week for the week of July 26th, 2010. I hope you're all doing well. Well, I tell you what, we've got uh, another interesting show coming up this Monday and I hope you all tune in Monday, July 26th at 1 p.m. at Des Moines Amplified.com. So uh, we're going to be going over some health news, of course, the good, bad, and the ugly. Um, kind of give you an example of what we're going to be talking about. We're going to be talking about the Prozac pollution. Huh? Yeah, it seems that uh, people, when they swallow Prozac or other antidepressants for that matter, uh, only about 5 to 10 percent is actually metabolized within the body, which that means that your liver has to deal with it. Uh, but the rest of it just goes down the drain. Uh, believe it or not. So you're basically polluting your water supply and there's more and more of it. What they're finding out is that um, shrimp are easy prey because they're all doped up on Prozac and whatnot. They're, they're not, they don't have their uh, natural survival skills. So how many other marine lives is that happening to? So, because they don't care. They're, they're not depressed about getting eaten, evidently. Uh, other news, the dangers of prescription drug abuse really hits home. And this is a story that I've been following for, gosh, you know, for the past 15 years. And the key word is prescription. So who are these doctors prescribing these drugs? And if they're not prescribed the drugs, then they're getting them illegally. So it means that uh, the pharmaceutical companies are basically flooding the market with a lot of medications that should be prescribed more than they should be. So why wouldn't they, they match the prescription rate? So either it's the doctors who are over prescribing or the pharmaceutical companies who are, over, are flooding the market with uh, uh, prescription drugs that uh, are basically sold and utilized illegally. Hmm, interesting, huh? How about this one? Do you think ultrasound is safe for babies? Well, I want you to think again. Where was that study? Oh, there it goes. Right there. News flash. Research shows that ultrasound populations have quadrupled the perinatal death rate. You know what? The United States has the highest infant mortality than any other country. Is ultrasound a contributing cause of that? Plus other things. Increased rates of brain damage, dyslexia, speech delays, epilepsy, learning uh, difficulties, and a 32% increase in left-handedness. Which, hey, you folks that are left-handed, they're, they're thinking that that's caused by brain damage. But uh, I don't know. So, hey, I'd like to apologize to you because giving you all this information all the time, you might think I'm a little pushy. And if you think that, then, then I'm sorry. If you know me personally, I'm not in your face all the time telling you, oh, get off those drugs. No, you've got lifestyle issues. You've got some health issues that you need to deal with. If you, if you want to ask me questions and utilize me as a guide, well, I'm here. You know, I'm, I'm not the type of person that gets in your face and, and, uh, and yells at you about your choices. Uh, that's just not cool, and I don't think that's a good way to make friends. Uh, and I don't think my friends think that of me. So uh, I wanted to apologize to you because if you feel that I'm too pushy or, or whatnot, uh, that's, that's not what I'm doing. I'm trying just to give you the information. And it's consistent information. Have you ever noticed that? I'm consistent in the information that I'm giving you, right? You can't deny that. Over the last 15 years, I've been pretty damn consistent. And what I've known, noticed after 15 years of collecting data is that it's all pretty consistent. Uh, the, the stuff that they found out about ultrasounds is the same stuff I was reading about 10 years ago but it comes out in the media. The only thing is, it's not front page news. So that means that, well, I'm sorry, but you as a society don't necessarily care about if it, if it isn't on the front page news or on CNN or, or uh, the world news tonight. So I'm digging, I'm doing the work for you. So you don't have to. So I can kind of bring this information up to you so you can make an informed decision about your healthcare choices. And uh, another way of doing that is the radio show at Des Moines Amplified.com this coming Monday, July 26th at what, 1 to 3 p.m. It's all about health, and I hope to see you there. Have a great day.
Hi, my name is Dr. Chad Rolfson, and if you're looking for a chiropractor in the Des Moines area, give me a call, 727-4000. Thanks.